Hello friends and welcome to ACC Updates India. Today we are here with our new video on ACC Remote Exam December 2020. The important FAQs that is frequently asked questions asked by the ACC students directly to ACC. Today we are going to discuss in this video those important FAQs asked by the ACC students. If you haven't seen our first video on the FAQs then go and watch the video now. Some important FAQs are also discussed in this video. The link for the video is in the description. So go and check out the video now. The video has almost crossed the 800 plus views. So it is one of the important video and you should check that out. So let us start the today's video. First let us see what are the exam booking FAQs asked by the ACCA students. The first FAQ is what are the ACCA exam fees for the remote session exams. The remote session exam are charged at the same rate as your center based exams. There are no any exam fee difference between the center based exams and the remote session computer based exam. So you have to pay the same amount as you pay for the center based exam. The next is will I be able to choose my exam slot? Yes, you will be able to select a preferred time slot for your exam within a specific time zone window based on your location. Based on your location you will be given a different time slots. Time slots are subject to availability and depending on your location you may be presented with one or more time zone windows. Time zone windows are represented by F1 F2 and F3 options during the booking process. Usually F1 is a time slot in the morning, F2 is a time slot of the afternoon and F3 is the time slot of the evening batches. So please select the respective F1, F2 or F3 as per your convenience. Let us see some before the exam FAQs asked by the ACC students. The first FAQ is will I be able to delete or block any software before taking the exam? So the answer is no. The remote invigilation software locks the computer during the exam time meaning you cannot access any file or other program on the computer during that time that is when you start the exam all the other windows are automatically blocked or rather you should close all the windows before starting your exam the next FAQ is can I use a dongle or a mobile hotspot a dongle is allowed if its purpose is to increase the Wi-Fi signal but it does should not have a user interface. Using a mobile hotspot is not allowed for any reason. This is one of the frequently asked question by many of the ACC students whether they are allowed to use the mobile hotspot. So the answer is no. You are not allowed to use your mobile hotspot for any reason. Next, where can I take the exam? That is, from which places can I conduct my remote exam? You can sit your exam at home or an alternative location such as your learning provider or an, in your office. You can sit your exam from your own home or any one of your learning provider from where you are taking your tuitions or from your offices. However, there are some 
important regulations which must be followed regardless of where you are sitting your exams whether you sit at your home or at your in learning provider or in your office you have to follow the regulations said by the acca the first is you must be sat at a desk in a closed quiet private room with a, no other people in the room for the full duration of the exams that is you should sit in a quiet room where not other than you should be there in your room the room must have solid walls and door that is not a glass so no other individual can see other yourself so the door or any wall should not be a glass protected it should be a solid wall so you cannot see anyone else or anyone else can't see you unfortunately if your room does not meet all these requirements you will not be able to start or complete your exam so this is one of the important faqs that you should refer to you should follow the instructions given by the acca relating to the place from where you are giving the exam we have started our new bookstore where the acca books can be available in a pdf format like study text exam kit or revision notes in this time of corona pandemic we are helping the students who have have financial crisis to get their books at the lowest cost also the students are facing difficulties in getting their books from the market so get your books by sitting at your home and just by placing your order on our mail id acc updates india at the rate gmail.com and that to at the very very lowest cost so if you haven't book your any book yet mail us on our email id and get the books at the lowest cost so the next faq is can i have a photograph or any picture on my walls yes as long as there is no writing or notes or whiteboard with the notes etc you can have any type of photograph and picture on your wall but if the invigilator is unsure of what is on the wall you may be asked to remove it the invigilator may ask you to show the paintings or photographs or pictures that is on your wall or it may be tell by the invigilator to remove that picture or photograph from your wall the next faq is do i need an exam docket one of the important faq asked by every acc students and the answer is no you do not need any type of exam docket for the remote session exams you only need the id proof some minimum specification requirements and nothing else so the next faq is can i make a request on a gender or nationality of the invigilator and the answer is no because the invigilator are randomly allocated to the students and may be from a different region from yourself you should therefore expect and dialogue with your invigilator to be conducted in english however there is no need to worry wherever you take your exam our exam regulations are the same and all the invigilators have been fully trained in administration over exams so the basic language where you have to contact with the invigilator is going to be english only so do not worry just study and give the exam our previous videos on acc remote exams you should refer to are the introduction to acc remote exams important faqs asked by the 
students part 1 the system requirements for acc remote exam and the acc remote exam full booking process this is our part 2 of acc faqs important asked by the acc students we are also coming with our third part on the acc remote exam faqs so be in touch with us subscribe to our channel so that you do not miss any one of your video thank you Thank you.